Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. So I just wanted to make a really, really quick update video talking about the new patch. Now, we kind of were expecting this. You know, two days ago, I made an update video kind of predicting what's going to be on the new patch. Um, I think I was half right because I was right about this light dark package being the Loki. Um, I guess that, you know, it was going to be a dark Loki fusing into a light Loki because, you know, it kind of, there was a pattern before of them releasing the succubus and then the tiger and then the succubus and the tiger were monsters that were buffed in a previous balance patch and um two other monsters that were buffed during that time was the loki and the wild thing so i kind of predicted that was going to be one of the two um i thought that the light loki was actually better than the dark one so i think it was more likely for them to basically um for this month since last month they released the light one first so i think they were going to alternate between the two um, for this to be a dark Loki fusing into a light Loki, although it doesn't really matter which one fuses into which. Um, so if you're unfamiliar with the package, basically what it is, is you buy it for 400 astrogems and it gives you a, a wood Loki. And then you can take this Loki and um, you basically, if you buy it 15 times, which is the equivalent of 6,000 astrogems, it will give you this dark Loki and this dark gleam, and you can use the two to fuse into this light Loki. So that's pretty much it. And then you'll have like 15 of these, so it'll be exactly enough for you to get this Loki to like straight to Evo 3. Um, I think he's a pretty decent monster for Titans. He's got a three turn attack down and a two turn, two turn armor break. He also has a defense lead if you can get him as a variant. So he's definitely a really nice monster. Um, kind of see predicted. <laughs> All right. Um, now this one, this one is a they they threw a, they threw me a curveball with this one. Um, they they actually you know I didn't I didn't think with them developing stuff um so so much th so many things they actually had time to to make a new monster for a new event. So I kind of predicted that they were gonna re-release an old event. But I was wrong about this. They were gonna they're gonna be releasing a completely new event. Um, now this is the Gemini. They look super cute. You know they're basically like twin lollies. Can't go can't really go wrong with this design. Um, and yeah, it's really interesting because we never had like these multiple monster monsters in in the game. So that's that's actually a pretty cool design. Um, now this is gonna be a capture event. Basically you can catch all these monsters. They, they have a fire counterpart as well as a light dark version. And the dark one comes, um, the, all the normal ones can drop from all regions. Um, the dark one is only in Phantom Forest. The light one is only in Lunar Valley and Aria Lake. And um, the four star Gemini encounter rate is similar to legendary Astrum on all, all difficulties. And that is actually pretty interesting. So you actually have a chance to get the light dark ones or as many as you can. Um, they also, come from rebirth so they're all also going to be included in the rebirth pool if you look over here um over here they they will be included in the rebirth the current rebirth pool in, in addition to the cocos which is actually really nice because in in this rebirth you only need to do 20 in order to get um one of these so i think that's really really nice i'll just definitely be farming a lot be uh, rebirthing a lot to, to try to get some of these. If they're really good, I'll just go really hard and farm as many as possible. But I probably will farm as many as possible anyways because I'm constantly farming story mode, so I'll, I'm gonna have like a shit ton um, anyways. So that's that doesn't really matter for me. And yeah, that is pretty much it. Now we don't have any information on the... Well, actually, there's a little bit of more information. Um, they're gonna be having these like light dark light dark gemini eggs that you can buy from the from the crystal shop um there's also going to be a fire gemini egg from the clan shop and they will also sell um soulstone pieces for the gemini which is actually pretty nice so if you buy these you can you know summon more of them um there's going to be a rocky package you can buy rockies and it costs 400 astrogems Purchase Rockies. Wait, what? There's gonna be... Oh, Loki. I'm fucking like... Jesus, that stupid Google Translate was... Was, was translating... Loki into Loki. I thought it was Rocky. Because there's a Rocky over here. God damn it. Um, so there's... There's gonna be a... Yeah, there's gonna be this. It, it was this. It was just this package. Um, 
yeah, that's pretty much it. So now I don't have any news about like the the actual monsters, their skill sets or anything like that. But once it comes out, I'll definitely be doing a review of the monsters and seeing if you should grab as many of them as you can. But it's really, I'm really happy. Like I, it's been so long since we had an event where you can like just farm as many as possible. And now I'm like confident because I can, I can like farm so damn hard right now. Like I got, I can just uh, you know speed through this shit like like mad. So that's, that's pretty much it. Um, thank you guys so much for watching, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.